Today we have something for you that has been heavily requested by our subscribers. Oh god, <laughs> no. I should trust them but I want to, but if it's heavily requested, I feel like it might not be good. You will be trying Sir Strumming. I'll be doing what now? What? It has fish on it. I hate seafood. I'm assuming it's fish. Oh, yeah, there's pictures of fish here. I'm just gonna assume it's like sardines. Because, I don't know, sardines come in cans. It's in a different language. Is it like Swedish or something? It's probably like Vegemite, where it's like really popular in another country, and then everyone over here hates it. Is this like the really smelly something or another? I think I've heard of it. I've seen PewDiePie eat this with uh, a good mythical morning. It's just like raw fish, isn't it? It shouldn't be that hard, it's just raw fish. So before you get to eating, we'll actually have to go outside for this. Why? Is it alive? Does it like stink that bad that we have to go outside? Oh man, well I hope I don't stink after. Okay, time to try it, so go ahead and open it up. I have never used one of these before, so we're gonna attempt to do this. It's a beautiful day, I'm alive, I'm okay. Whoa! Do you guys hear that? It's like, it's like sizzly. Ew! Ew! Ah! Oh! Oh, that smells so bad! Oh, it smells like a porta potty. No, dude, that smells really, really bad. <laughs> uh, it smells like my dog's poop. <laughs> Jeez, that that is bad. Ugh, I just keep getting whiffs. Oh, uh, this smell's not gonna come out, is it? It smells like cat food, but like like 50 times worse than cat food. I'm telling you right now, no way I'm eating this. I'm outside, I can make a run for it. Oh, do I have to touch it to get the lid out? I'm just gonna go for it. Ew, ew, ew! Oh, that's just a fish. They want us to eat this? I expected like kind of like tuna, like shredded fish, but there's, oh! I was gonna get sushi after this? Yeah, that's not happening anymore. All right. Ta-da! <laughs> I can't do it. Is this puke bucket for me? Okay. <coughs> I don't think I can do it. Hey, it's really salty. I think it's just the smell, honestly. Oh, it doesn't actually smell that bad. It's like what garbage smells like in your mouth. Whoa, that was so salty. I was not expecting that. Not that bad, to be honest. It just kind of tastes really salty. It just smells so gross. Thanks, you <laughs> That's really salty. <gasps> Oh my goodness. It was slimy on the inside, but then kind of like rough on the outside from the scales and hard to bite through. Oh, ah! oh that's so hot! <laughs> Dude, that's disgusting. Tastes like fish, but like nasty, nasty raw fish. Go big or go home. I changed my mind, go small and go home. It's like someone took a cat excrement and then added all of the salt to it. One, two, three. It's just a bad, just really super strong fish taste. Like, I love fish. That, that was not good. You just ate strumming, which is fermented herring. Okay, I've heard the word herring in fantasy books before. Fish is already like fishy enough. I don't think you really need to ferment it. Fermented, like why? Why? Why is it smell, fish already smells in and of itself. Why do you have to let it smell even more? According to a Japanese study, it is one of the most putrid smells in the world. It is one of Sweden's most infamous products. I definitely believe that. It is, it's really disgusting. Thanks Sweden. I don't think I've ever smelled anything this bad. The taste was not as bad as the smell. Like I can still 
still smell it on my like nose and lips and that's making me want to throw up. But the taste was just like a fish. I'm gonna see like my friends today and they're gonna be like, you smell like you just like dove into like an aquarium full of like fish. So finally, do you recommend that people eat surstrumi? Do not eat this. Don't eat it, no. Don't do it. It's not worth it. Absolutely not. Look at this. You guys want to put this in your mouth? Why? Yeah. I always recommend trying every weird, stupid, harmless thing at least once. Never even get close to this. Yes. You're bored at home and you just have a can of this laying at home for whatever reason. Just do it with your friends. Like, why not? Usually I'm like, hey, keep an open mind. But no, like that, just don't even do it. Thanks for watching Teens vs. Food on the React channel. What food should we eat next? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. New shows every week. Bye, guys. Hey, guys, I'm Katie, a React channel producer. Thank you so much for all your suggestions for this episode. It was a fun one for me. Love you guys.